Hey folks, welcome back to Let's Play Legend of Mana on the series JG. There seemed to be a bit of a desync between my commentary and the gameplay at the end of the last video. Uh, like, by the end of the last video, it was kind of noticeable. Um, I have done nothing to address that. I'm just going to record another video and see what happens, because I'm a hobbyist. <laughs> I mean, I'm just telling you guys, it's a hobby. Um, it wasn't, like, game-wreckingly bad. I'm not making any money off of this anyway. I'm just going to record 30 more minutes and see if... You know, it didn't seem like it was happening with my other games, but then I didn't—I wasn't looking for it on like Yakuza and stuff I was recording the other day, so maybe it was there. Um, I do not know, but anyway, our friend uh, Duella the Onion Knight is telling us to sell monsters that we don't like, keep the rest as our slaves. Tenor from the item shop and Domino will buy them from you. She can be a tight rod, but she's the only buyer around. Anyway, eggs take a few days to hatch. Fully grown monsters will become very attached to you and will follow you everywhere. They grow more powerful by gaining experience. You won't find a better adventuring partner. Oh yeah, monsters' diet affects its growth. Try feeding them different foods to see what happens. Monsters will only eat after they've gained a level. So if you want them to eat, you have to let them graze or take them out with you. Now you know what to do. How your monsters grow up is entirely to you. Well then, up to you. <clears throat> so... Monster Crawl, the end. Okay. <clears throat> I guess we can completely screw up these monsters. There's probably like a different... I think there's a different section of the fact on how to raise them, but... It also says... To get days to pass, I need to walk around. And then when I do that... Eventually the monster egg will hatch. So let's see if that causes it to hatch. There doesn't seem to be a monster out here running around. So maybe enough time didn't pass. Oh, here we go. The beast egg hatched. That's not shockingly, it's a rabbit. Let's call it uh, beast egg. It's the default name is beast egg. Rabbit. You know what? That works. I, I could be like naming them after, you know people who watch the channel, LPers, whatever, but then I don't know which ones I'm going to keep as my slaves and which ones would be sold for cash. So I'd hate to, like, have somebody who's really attached to the series and their, their monster is named and then sold for cash. Take a pet, feed, raise, sell, ring ring land, encyclopedias. Let's let it graze for now. be raised to be my loyal slave, even though I'm not going to spend any attention to it, so it'll just hang out and graze for a while. You with you put in the barn, pet it. Rabbit is without any particular personality. <laughs> okay, well, thanks. Thanks for announcing that game. It's nice that it just kind of hangs out with you. It wants to be your friend. Do they get personalities as they level up? I don't know. But we better go report this to Little Cactus before it's lost forever. I studied magic at the academy. I learned all about the seven wisdoms of man. But one of them died, so now there's only six. Really? I sure would like to meet them someday. I wonder where they are. Hey, take me to search for those wisdoms. Yes. Now you're talking. The pursuit of wisdoms. Uh-oh. It's hopefully not a problem that I already started this. Let's see how fixed the package today. So he's gonna follow us around. Oh crap. I hope I didn't just break it so that we can't pet. Yeah, unless the pursuit of wisdoms is already next, I think we got this uh You, ne you never never talk to anyone or you'll break the game, apparently. Alright, so I'm just checking real quick. How... Pursuit of Wisdoms, where... How, how far do we have to go to get to that? I 
it, I still haven't seen it yet. It is on this thing. They, they kind of do them in groups, but, um... I didn't see Pursuit of Wisdoms at all. I missed it somewhere. Wisdom of Gaius is up pretty high. Path of the Blacksmiths. In Search of Fairies. The Seven... Maybe this is called the Seven Wisdoms. That's like 32. That's like halfway through their list. We already started this event. But here's how you finish it. Take by the Luan Highway. Oh, Wisdom 1 Gaius. Okay. Alright, I guess we're, we're doing okay. So, the Wisdom of Gaius... I don't know. I'm confused. But, um... Apparently we're supposed to take Bud to meet these Wisdoms, but it wasn't telling me to do that. Well, we know we're not going to need this Nicholas save point again, so, like, if we screw this up, because we shouldn't have Bud with us, I guess it'll be okay. We'll probably get kicked out of the party when someone else needs to be our party member, because we only get two at a time. Let's see if he says anything when we talk to these guys. He does not respond to his talking to. No, I did mean to leave, though. Super high level monster rabbi. Alright. I sure hope I'm doing these in the right order. Jeez. Yeah, want Wisdom of Gaius is number four. It's part of the quote fairy arc. There's a couple of different arcs, and this is the fairy arc. So we are to go to the top left door in the center of town, the inn. Avoided this building like the plague, but now we're here. Welcome to Manus Bustard. I miss Yuka, the owner of this inn. That's my little Pee Wee. He's quite fragile, so please leave him be. Save to P control oh nothing. There's a telephone, that's nice. So she owns the oh there actually see see this one's like it might be a pad, it might not. I'm selling minerals I've mined around here. Buy item, sell item, council. We don't have any money, jeez. I guess I spent like everything. Okay, well, I need to grind for money if I want to do anything with money. But I think this is where the actual quest quest is. That was really wrong. Got bird meat by robbing somebody's room. Enter the room on the right on the bottom floor. Oh. Okay, I didn't even know there was a room to the right on the bottom floor. Another reason you might oh see now there's a little welcome mat though, that should have told me. Another reason you can miss quests, just not knowing that the room exists. And we you were the character that I thought I saw before. Now say, what do you know about the mana tree? This and that, or nothing. You don't have to play along. There's no such thing, I know that. What happens to our souls after we die? They disappear, or they live forever. You have to tell her they live forever, I guess. I think so too. I've been wounded, I've been wounded a hundred times, but no foe has ever hurt my soul. I can't believe that my soul would ever disappear. I want to go meet Gaia. I'll go with you. Go by yourself. Tell her you will go with her and see Gaia, and she will join the party. Thanks, but I'm not one for big groups. Sorry for being fussy. Why do I ditch the kid? See, I, I did screw this up. I don't know how to get rid of the kid. Oh, for crying out loud. Please don't tell me I have to capture the, um... 
I have to capture the monster egg again because I talked to the kid. This is the thing, like, maybe there's a way to ditch the kid and I just don't know what it is? Maybe I take to the kid to the Luan Highway and he's like, Whoa, this is too dangerous, I'm leaving. I mean, it's worth a try. Or if I uh, take the rabbi along with me, he might just leave the party. I'm under the impression he's like, uh, he'd be fighting with me. You can never have more than... Boink. What? Oh, it's a teleporter. Well, it doesn't seem like the kid is, uh... Avatar Canyon. The kid doesn't seem to be afraid to be in the party. He's going for Dirt Harp. Okay, so the kid is a companion I can have with me. Talking to that hippo creature, um, definitely did something. All right, I need to get the kid out of the party, and hopefully that doesn't destroy his quest. You can see how I'm terrified of, like, doing anything. Because the guide is like, do this very specifically and you'll get all the quests. But, um... I don't know if once you've started a quest, you can lock yourself out of it. I, I think it's very possible to, s to get it so a quest will never spawn. But I don't know if you can make it so quests are unwinnable once you've got them started. But as you can see, that's how magic works in this game. It's got area of effect. It doesn't automatically hit everything. But the kid's not gonna level up this way. Okay. And that character I saw here, I think this is where we've got to go to, to do the quest she wants to do, so... Maybe she shows up there and this is an ultimate place you can recruit her if you don't have anyone else in your party. Either way, at this point, we just want to get out of here. I guess I missed a pickup because that's why the battle wasn't showing us over. Already. crazy with the magic, but I guess if you got the points, it's fine. Alright. So this kid's not leveling up at all, because he's not picking up any of the leads, but... I believe we're gonna get an item and a quest coming up, which will make that less of an issue. Where your characters will share experience. And I believe that, because it's what I just read in the page about how to do this quest that we're not being allowed to do because the kid joined us. <clears throat> Ask me anything. I was hoping maybe we could ask about that hippo. Alright, so don't talk to the hippo. Because we don't want to get teleported to the middle of this map. Wisdom of Gaius. Yeah, so we really, just any time I step away from the walkthrough, I have reason to be concerned that we've just changed something and we can't do what, whatever it is we set out to do. Like, I do not know where to go with this kid to finish his quest. I don't even know how to see what quest we already have open. These are sad, that's not where I wanted to be. Alright, so let's try going here and seeing if we can take Pikachu with us. Oh, it won't 
Okay, I take it with you. Oh, now they're both following me. How do I get rid of them? I th see ya. Oh, if you go into the, ho the house, he leaves. Okay, that's a relief. Apparently taking the Pikachu along with us is fine. We can't have a another character who isn't a monster, I guess. So let's try taking Pikachu and see if that wrecks anything. I was going to let Pikachu graze. Because it did seem like they would grow just from grazing. Okay. Well, crisis averted. I think we can go back to doing things in sequence and having... Told that kid we would go on a quest, and I, hopefully that doesn't break things. If it does, I'll be annoyed. Because that is that is making, even by the standard, or the, the rep this game has, that is way too easy a way to just, like, derail content. Talk to this character. Because if I had said no, I was worried if I would said no, it would also have broken the chain. I want to go meet Gaia. I'll go with you. Thank you. I knew you'd say, I knew you'd say that. Let's go. The wisdom of Gaia. Now, Domino's level 3, so she is less powerful than Nicola was by the time I was done grinding, but more powerful than Nicola was when we started her quest. So we are going to go together with Catwoman here to... Yeah, she's running around like a cat. If that's your thing, you're super turned on right now. And we are going to go meet Gaia, who is one of the Earth Spirits. Or the Earth Spirit, I should say. I thought, wait, Gaia? Wasn't it Gnome in people? I don't know. I guess we'll find out. Yeah, Gnome is still something separate from Gaia. So Gaia might be a different kind of spiritual divinity in this game. Actually, this thing's teleport might help us get there faster. See a fork in the road. Take it. You guys are really having trouble with this thing, aren't you? We're definitely forming electric chains of human sympathy here. Okay, so the cat lady got more experience than I did, and the chocobo got nothing. Well, it's not a chocobo, it's a, uh... Rabbi, but here's a chocobo, which I didn't think was a thing in the, the mana games. Flaming Quill, nobody got any experience, so. This one was, I don't know how you would know that Gaia is here, but this is where you're supposed to go on this quest. We got Odd Meat. The Odd Meat, have you seen? We acquired Strange Wolf. Oh, here's Gaia here, so I suppose eventually you'd explore and find this thing. Welcome. Welcome. Come closer. Hopefully my dialogue is in sync with the screen. JG will be looking into that. Okay. I suppose I should get back to the guide and find out. Make sure you're not supposed to... If you go closer, it will be automatic game over. <laughs> Although if it was, I'd want to showcase that probably. Um... Talk to these... Okay, this is, this is just going to be dialogue. Because this is a friendly red spirit, I guess. Hello, girl. What do you wish to know? My friend is dying from a demon's curse. What can I do to help her? Do what your friend wants you to do. Become friends with the benefits. She won't even ask me for help. She thinks that this is just how things are meant to be. Then you must accept that. I'm not very helpful. Do you understand what she is trying to tell you? No, I 
don't. I just don't get why she's giving up like this. She was always so strong, but that demon weakened her in body and spirit. I guess I have to throw in a meow to indicate that I'm so sweet cat. I only want to help her get back to her old self. People have the power to make their own decisions. That is what she is trying to teach you. Listen to her words. Dot dot meow dot. Thank you. I'll try to take a more level-headed approach. By the way, I there should be an ancient tree beside your house. Well, there should be, but it's too lazy to show up. He will help you with many things. You are welcome to return any time. I will give you more useless advice on how not to save your friend. Welcome, come closer. I didn't mean to do that. No. I did not actually mean to come closer. Thank you for coming with me. I feel a lot better in here. Please take this. And she kicks in the nuts. You get Forbidden Ring. And she leaves my party. Or do I get to teleport back to safety? Wisdom of Gaia, the end. Okay. Okay. See, that's the thing. It's, this game is a collection of really short little quests with no central unifying story. Like, we meet some guy named Niccolo. We help him defeat some bandits. Then we defeat some kids. Then they become our apprentices. And then, even though we don't know magic, and they do, and then stuff. It's weird. But we should go home. And I, I'm going to continue to hold out, like, just keep my fingers crossed we didn't break our quest to take that kid to see uh, spirits. But now we know where one is. I could, like, really push my luck and take him to visit that spirit. And do I have to equip this ring? Rabbi is at level 20 because it's gained no experience at all during any of that. Um, weapon is the Mento Sword. It's the Fresh Maker. Cancel. It says the Iron Pot is better than the Helm. So the. There's a Forbidden Ring. Like the the game has told me the Forbidden Ring, or rather this this fact says, will share experience with all your party members. I don't see where the game is telling me that at any point. Okay, you have two. Oh, never mind. It says. Okay, yeah, this is doing better defense than the Iron Pot would. Yeah, so I'm not sure... Like, the game doesn't do a good job of explaining to you what's happening. Um, but it does appear... Like, if this thing has the effect, the fact says it does, I'm I'm not looking in the right places to find out about that. So I might have to go check uh, the library or something. Big face. Yeah, big face. That's, that's my takeaway, too. Characters, techniques, monsters, equipment. All right. Oh, that's right. It doesn't give you individual equipment, does it? It just... Summer plane, others. Some are said to hold incredible power. Yeah, it doesn't... T it's okay, so this, it's not going to tell me here what it does. Although I do have artifacts that we haven't used yet. The flame... That which illuminated the shrine was but a small flame. Before long, mankind ceased to notice the fire, but its significance continued to grow nonetheless. Okay. Medallion, a wise man who could have command the animals, was devoured by a beast from a foreign land. The creature gained wisdom and began a, became a learned, learned sage itself. Interesting.
Good. This is twin brother. He thinks that he's a great sorcerer. There's so much to learn. He was kicked out of the Academy of Magic for being too mischievous. His frying pan was once his mother's. Lisa, better sorcerer than her twin brother Bud. She carries around her father's old broomstick as a memento. Interesting. They each have a momentum from a parent, but it's the opposite gendered parents. Um, she often makes mistakes and is not always on time, but she doesn't seem to care. Typical of a postman. Burn. Sorry. Hey, what do you call the uh, pelican? Uh, he used to work at the post office and doesn't have that job anymore. Just some pelican. Alright, so we're going to save and. Um, I guess. I don't know. I don't know what to make of this um, situation where I'm worried that we. Uh, I guess we'll save over this lot, because if we if we screwed up, this, we're going to have to come save over this. If it's, like, permanently destroyed, our chances of getting 100%, I guess we're going to have to learn to live with it. Meanwhile, what if we talk to her? Why not take me with you? I guarantee I'll be more useful than Bud. Oh, you know what? No, wait, hold on. We did get a quest, though. All right. Come, you're taking Lisa. We did get we did get told that we had a quest with him though. What I'm really not getting here is um You know the quest you're involved with, the pursuit of wisdoms, okay. Oh Bud made the six wisdoms. Okay, I guess we're and it's specific to Bud. Okay, bye, try not to have a good time without me, whatever it was she said. And it's called, but it's called the Six Wisdoms, right? There, there might be some differences between this fact and the game because of they might have translated it differently f uh, when they made the remake. But um, I was trying to find, do I have a, a quest called the Six Wisdoms? Because that didn't seem to be what it was called before. And if it's just that they are, nope. Wisdom of Gaius. The Seven Wisdoms. Oh, it's called the Pursuit of Wisdom, not the... Not whatever. The Seven Wisdoms is like Quest 32. I don't know why they, they take so long to get to it, but... It says, you already started this event, but here's how you find it. Finish it. Okay, it's, this seems like one that you can do whenever. The video is pretty much over, though. All right, yeah, so I got pretty confused there and a little nervous that we'd messed up, but it seems like we're probably fine. Um, and we can take him to meet the first of the wisdoms, but we got a whole bunch of other wisdoms to find, so that might be why they don't bother to do it until late. It's just like, once you found all seven wisdoms, have this kid in your party and visit all of them again, and this quest is completed. And I don't think having it open and uncompleted is going to break the universe, but I've been wrong before. Not necessarily about breaking the universe, though. I'm Sirius JG. I want to thank you guys for watching. I'm hoping that the sound sync issue is just like a freak issue and not repeating, but I guess I'll find out when I review this video. You'll find out if you're paying attention. <laughs> like, hold on. Why not take me with you? I guarantee I'll be more useful than Bud. No. Okay, I'll stay and hold the fort. Now you can determine whether I was like way, way off because I basically read the text as soon as it appeared. Now you will know the secret of whether or not I'm having sync issues. <laughs> the secret that will be you.